the economy around. We know that Margaret Thatcher turned Great Britain around when it was in desperately bad trouble in 1979, worse trouble than we're in now. So we know there are policies that work. And so as I was working out this, thinking about job killing versus job creating, about two weeks ago, I ran across a little article that said that in June and July, the United States actually paid more people food stamps than ever before in American history. And I thought to myself, we now have a pretty good sense of what the real Obama redistribution policy is. When you lose your job, they'll give you food stamps. And I said, this is really wrong. This is fundamentally wrong. The American people don't want food stamps. They want a paycheck.
Chancellor Merkel of Germany and President Sarkozy uh, of France, he was asked the question, what do you think about American exceptionalism? And the answer he gave was so, such a clear indication he didn't have a clue what the question was. He said, well, you know, Americans think they're exceptional, but then British think they're exceptional, and Greeks think they're exceptional. This was, this was a statement of such utter lack of understanding of American history that it was a poem. And explains a lot of why this administration is in such deep trouble. So let me just take a minute to talk about American exceptionalism as a historian. The core founding document of the United States is a fact. Remember I said 2 plus 2 equals 4 is a fact. I like it working from facts, not theories. It is a fact, and if you go to the National Archives, you will see a document signed by politicians which declared our independence. It was the basis of the whole system. That document says, we are endowed by our Creator with certain So the under-happy can be compensated. 
There's no provision for a lawyer to sue because your happiness and title doesn't come through. <laughs> and finally, the founding fathers would have thought you were crazy if you suggested that a politician could come in this room, take from the overly happy to redistribute to the unrelated. <laughs> Thank you.